फ्रेंड्स यू आर मोस्ट वेलकम इन निरंकारी वीडियो चैनल इस वीडियो लिंक में हम लोग रिप्रोडक्शन इन ऑर्गेनिज्म चैप्टर के अंतर्गत आर्टिफिशियल मेथड्स ऑफ वेजिटेटिव प्रोपेगेशन देखेंगे आर्टिफिशियल मेथड्स ऑफ वेजिटेटिव सेवरल मेथड्स ऑफ वेजिटेटिव प्रोपेगेशन और मैन मेड सेवरल मेथड्स ऑफ वेजिटेटिव प्रोपेगेशन और मैन मेड and developed by plant growers and developed by plant growers and horticulturist farm and horticulturist farm कमर्शियल प्रोडक्शन ऑफ क्रॉप कमर्शियल प्रोडक्शन ऑफ क्रॉप्स दे आर कॉल्ड आर्टिफिशियल मेथड्स कॉल्ड आर्टिफिशियल मेथड्स ऑफ वेजिटेटिव प्रोपे केसन दे आल्सो इनक्लूड सेवरल मेथड्स ऑफ प्रोपेगेशन सच ए यूज ऑफ पोटैटो ट्यूबर्स फॉर ग्रोइंग पोटैटो क्रॉप्स कमर्शियली सिमिलर राइजोम्स ऑफ जिंजर कॉर्नस ऑफ बनाना एंड बल्ब्स ऑफ ऑनियन रनर्स ऑफ मेन are artificially used for commercial production of these crops some of the artificial methods are given below number first is cutting a small piece of any plant organ a small piece of any plant आर्गन स्टेम रूट आर लिंक स्टेम रूट आर लिंक यूज फॉर प्रोपेगेशन इज कॉल्ड यूज फॉर प्रोपेगेशन इज कॉल्ड कटिंग leaf cutting are used to propagate leaf cutting are used to propagate begonia bryophyllum begonia bryophyllum ग्लोसिनिया ग्लोसिनिया एंड कलंकी कलंकी रूट कटिंग आर यूज टू प्रोपेगेट रूट कटिंग आर यूज टू Prope get citron and tamarind. Citron and tamarind. Stem cutting are most commonly used for stem cuttings are most. 
common leap. Use the first artificial vegetative propagation. Artificial vegetative propagation. About 20 to 30 centimeter long pieces of stem are planted in the natural position in the soil for proper uh, sprouting. Factors such as age of the parent plant, length and diameter of the cutting season and the type of plant are taken into consideration for propagation of particular species. Sometimes the stem cutting are treated with a rooting hormone. Sometimes the stem cuttings are the stem cuttings are treated with IBA indole butyric acid butyric acid that is a, a plant hormone plant hormone of group Oxin. Oxin. Example of plants propagated by cutting. Example of plants propagated by cuttings are crepes, sugarcane. Grapes, sugar cane, rose, and and rose. Number second method is a layering. Layering. In this method, roots are artificially induced. In this method, roots are artificially induced on the stem branches. On the branches before they are detached from before they are detached from parent plant for propagation parent plant for propagation Layering is of uh, following types, mound layering and uh, air layering. Third method is uh, grafting. Third method is uh, grafting. It is the most common method of vegetative propagation described by ancient gardeners. Long before the science of horticulture become established in this method, parts of two plants are joined in such a way that they grow as one plant. Grafting is done between the two closely related dicotyledonous plants having vascular cambia. The rooted supporting portion of one plant is called stalk, is joined with a twig of another plant called cyan. Generally, the root stalk belongs to a wide variety which is resistant to disease and pest and poses an efficient root system for absorption of water and minerals. So, in this method, we have two plants to cut and cut and cut. The plant is called the plant to stalk and the plant is called the plant to cyan. So, friends, in this video link, we have so much. In the video link, we have जो है प्रोपेगेशन ऑफ प्लांट टिश्यू बाय कल्चर या माइक्रो प्रोपेगेशन 
या सूक्ष्म प्रवर्धन के बारे में चर्चा करेंगे थैंक्स <coughs> <coughs>